It was perhaps the defining moment of the 21st century and it came right at the beginning. The type of event that most people will witness only once in a lifetime. Leaving America vulnerable and shocked, the 9-11 attack set in motion events that would change the world forever. Terrorism had a face and a name. The US was waging a war. 18 years on, has America defeated terrorism? The US has ensured that there were no major attacks by foreigners on its soil. The attack left a stench that New Yorkers could smell for weeks after, as vestiges continued to be recovered from the ashes. Shocked and vulnerable after 9-11, the US honed in on confronting terrorists and protecting the homeland. And they have done a commendable job. The US is safer from the orchestrated attack that shocked Americans on the morning of September 11. Strict regulations have ensured no major terror attack for 18 years. But the incident has set into motion a series of events right in its backyard. Since 9-11, anti-Muslim activities have been on the rise. In August 2016, a New York imam and his associate were shot and killed on a busy street near their mosque in Queens. Police say it was a hate crime. According to research reports, assaults against Muslims in the US increased by almost 50% after 9-11. Another survey revealed that half of the Muslims in the US found it harder to be happy with their identity. In 2017, when Trump first tried to stop citizens of seven predominantly Muslim countries from entering the US, he cited the September 11 terrorist attacks as his rationale. Interestingly, none of the terrorists behind those attacks hailed from these countries. Also, anti-immigrant fervor has been increasingly mainstreamed over the last 10 years. This has led to much stricter immigration policies and complementary executive actions. Both the Democrats and Republicans remain divided in their perceptions of America's national character. The Republican Party basically sees the true national identity of America as it has been in the past. A time when America was a white Christian nation. And then there is the Democratic Party. It's for a more secular, inclusive America and celebrates diversity. The political ideologies of the Democrats and the Republicans have also seeded into American society. Gun violence in America has become a national security emergency. What's more, radicalization and white nationalism and supremacy are on the rise in the United States. And many of the most recent mass shootings have been fueled by violent racist rhetoric. The shooting in El Paso was preceded by the posting of a manifesto, which articulated a Hispanic invasion of Texas and details to divide America into territories defined by race. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One.